Much is written today about talent and talent management, and organizations are looking to compete and even win in the war on talent. And I'm here to talk about the fact that I believe, and we at Predictive Success believe, that if you want to win or even compete in this war on talent, you must start with your managers. In our work with the Leadership Pipeline Institute, we look at the leadership pipeline and the progression through the pipeline. And the first progression in that pipeline is identified as the most difficult. And it is moving from an individual contributor, managing yourself, to managing others. And what we're finding is that most organizations are not taking the time and applying the resources to select the best candidates at this level. And so our approach at Predictive Success is to first and foremost work with organizations to clearly define the management role. Looking at the job description, being clear on the expectations and the role and the responsibilities, but most importantly is identifying the behavioral capabilities of those folks. Once we've identified those capabilities, we can take a look at each of the candidates and prospects for the role to do two things. First and foremost, to clearly explain to them what the impact of taking this role is. What's the difference from them moving from an individual contributor to a leader of others? Once the organization has clearly defined the role, they can now work with the individual to address fits and gaps. They can be coached, they can be mentored, they can be developed to be more effective leaders. And the last thing that we really can help that new leader with at Predictive Success is giving them great insight, a roadmap into their teams. How will they manage? How will they coach? How will they develop other people to be successful?